Coach's Corner. Hello, I'm Coach Jenkins, and I'm, I'm the girls' basketball coach here. I do cross country and track, uh, Stuco, a little bit of FCA as well, and um, more importantly, I teach math as well. So um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about who I am today. Well, uh, I'm pretty boring person uh, as far as hobbies go. I have three little children, so I would say Kylie Carter and Cooper are my hobbies. Uh, Kylie is seven in first grade, Carter is five in kindergarten, and Cooper turns two on the 21st of September. So my life revolves around them. I'm going to actually be broadening my um, coaching career because I'm going to coach them in soccer, which I don't know much about. So if you want to help me coach soccer, I am game at the RYSA field. So. Uh, yeah, it's hobbies would be my kids. Um, I've always loved sports. My dad is a huge sports person. Uh, went with him to multiple games. We played um, softball and basketball all through growing up. So I witnessed him being my coach when I was younger and being a mentor to other children uh, that were in my grade and my sister's grades as well. Uh, got to high school, kind of thought the same thing, junior high as well of uh, I really love this sport and I love being around others and I want to make others better so um, that drew me to coaching basketball and I was good at teach good at math as a student came easy to me so I thought to ensure I always had a job I would go with math and um, I would be a math teacher and coach so what drew me actually here was the, the small town community. The fact that I can walk up and down the hallway and pretty much name almost every kid. Um, these students that went to elementary school, the same elementary together. They went to the same junior high and intermediate and they're now in high school together. Um, so the small town feel uh, is incredible. I know our students um, might not like the small town feel at times, but I'm telling you, as you grow up and become an adult and look back, you're going to have some great memories. I went to Crandall uh, and graduated from there in 05. So I graduated with 135 students. So that's basically kind of where we're at, maybe a little bit bigger pushing it, but uh, I love the small town feel that, that our school has um, and the sense of community we have. Oh, okay. So I'll have to tell you too. I don't, Maybe not a hobby, but kind of an interest. Um, it makes me feel old, but I like watching General Hospital, which is a soap opera. Uh, my husband actually got me into it, and he said he watched his mother watch it. My grandmother is Puerto Rican, and she watched um, All My Children, I believe. And I remember being young and seeing her watch watch her shows and, and that kind of thing. So I do watch a soap opera. Uh, and man, I am a, I fall for every Hallmark movie. I know what the ending is going to be, but I love that because I don't have to think about it. I'm busy enough in my career and my family that when I watch something, I just want it to be simple. Uh, I don't want to have to think much. So Hallmark movies are my go-to and uh, General Hospital as well. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. Uh, thank you to Mr. Lance putting this together so that y'all are able to get to know your teachers and coaches on a different level. Um, there's so many great things on our Wildcat Legend channel, so I believe it would be like below here. There's a red button down there that you need to click. Um, give them a thumbs up, give them a like, uh, give them a subscription so that we can help share what's going on here at Reigns High School and Reigns ISD.